Barnabies. How are you today? Ah, wow. First day using my new uh, ring light, so hopefully this works. Um, so today is week one of the Movie Marquee Challenge that I am doing with Heather the Crochet Witch. Uh, <laughs> Heather put out her video today and I was just about ready to go to work and I saw it and I went, oh, is today the day? <laughs> I, I was in a panic because I thought, oh man, I haven't picked out my yarn. I haven't picked out my project. I, you know, haven't done a video. So I went and did my short shift at work and, uh, went to Michael's right away, picked out a yarn and, you know, as Sandy Duda would say, hoochie 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 lobster. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm here to tell you what kind of project and yarn I'm going to be using for this challenge. If you don't know what I'm talking about, there's a playlist down below, uh, that, tells you everything and uh, shows you the projects that we have done in the past. But the basis around it is each month, Heather and I take turns picking a movie uh, of the month and we take the, the colors from that poster for the movie poster and we make a project. Heather's doing all blankets and I'm doing whatever I can. <laughs> I, uh, I've done a whole bunch of different things and, um, I'm running out of ideas <laughs> to be honest. Thank goodness. The year is almost over. <laughs> so, so this project, uh, or this challenge is all year long. Um, and yeah, so this month was my month to choose and I picked fifth element. There's a lot of colors in that poster. I'll put it right here. So as you can see, I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> like I didn't, I, mm. um, I actually, I was looking through my stash and I gave away my yellow yarn, the only yellow yarn I had. And I went, hmm. I don't have any of these colors. <laughs> so off to Michael's I go. Um, I did find a Karen cake that had all the colors in it, but I can't use it because it is wool. It's got wool in it. So I had another cake, uh, chunky Karen chunky cake. I think it was called. And I was like, oh, this should work. And they only had like two, maybe three. And I went, okay, that's not going to make a very big project because it's got very little yardage in it. So I went and I asked the, the lady that was working there, I says, do you have any more of these? And she looked it up and sure enough, she didn't, but they were coming in next week. I thought, oh. I don't want to wait that long. She goes, wait a minute, let me go look. She goes up and she's looking around. She looks up and she was like, oh, and she grabbed something that she thought was the same, but it wasn't, but it was the same colors. And I went, I, how many do you have of that? <laughs> so, um, it didn't have wool in, wool in it. So I was like, yay, happy mistake. And, uh, so I went and got some. I got four of them and ugh, let me grab them. They are the Karen Big Cake. And look at those colors. Let me put the poster up again. And tell me that's not perfect colors. I'm a smart art. <laughs> so yeah, it's got like, it's even got the green in it. And if you look at the poster, the green is hidden. You know, it's like just little bits of it. So I was like, okay, this will work. 
this will work. So what do I do? I go overboard and I buy four of them. Because <laughs> I was in panic mode and I thought, oh, I don't want to, I don't want to go there if I need more and find out they don't have any. So these, I'm sure you guys all know these, this brand and stuff. So it's 100% acrylic. God, I am a hot mess, guys. I'm so sorry. But I did just get off work, so... <laughs> Okay, it's a medium four weight. It's 100% um, acrylic. There's 551 meters, uh, 603 yards. So that's like over 2,000, way over 2,000 yards that I'm going to have to make something. So I messaged Heather and I says, hey, I got the yarn. And then I thought, oh, I don't have a project. So I'm thinking, do I want to make a sweater? No. It's like, okay, what do I want to make? And then I thought about it and thought about it and thought about it and thought about it. And then I came up with something that's probably going to shock Heather. <laughs> it kind of shocked me. But I'm going to make a blanket. Yeah, I'm going to make a Jacob's Ladder blanket. Eh? Don't you think that if I made a black blanket with this as the Jacob's Ladder, that won't be stunning? Hello. So in the poster, there's a lot of black. So I thought, and then the black kind of go outlines all the colors in the poster. So I thought, why not have a black blanket with the Jacob's ladder going through it? I thought, okay, I like that idea. I am stoked for that idea. Problem is <laughs> that blanket will might probably take up maybe one cake. So now I've got three other cakes of this yarn. But that's okay. That's okay. I'm sure I can use it or I could put it in a giveaway or something. Who knows? Um, but I thought that that would be wonderful. And then, of course, I came up with this idea after I left Michael's, right? And I'm going, I didn't pick up any black. <sighs> So I'm going to have to go back and get some because this stuff is all like bulky six. That's not going to be any good. And I usually have more black in my stash like this. This won't work because it's like a three and it's the texture of it is not not going to work. This is more cottony feel to it. And then I've got. Uh, oh, I've got some other cotton right there uh, that's got sparkle in it. But again, it's cotton. It's not going to work. So I'm going to have to go. I'll probably go to Walmart and go pick up some basic, um, Premier Basic and, in black if they have it. And go with that. So, yeah. So I'm really, I'm excited. I'm excited about this. These are not the colors that I normally go for. So I'm, I'm sure that it's just going to pop like crazy um, against the black. So, yes. So that is what I'm going to do. <laughs> uh, okay, so now uh, we hope that you guys will join in. And you don't have to make a blanket. You can make whatever you want. And if you could put your picture of it in our Facebook groups, that would be fantastic. They're both linked down below. Um, and join in. It's a lot of fun. It's like you've got all month to make something. It's not like you have to have it done right away. Uh, even, but then even, 
<laughs> we're finding sometimes even a month isn't long enough because we got so much other stuff going on plus work and all this other stuff so <laughs> we're we're on we're on this struggle bus <laughs> so a lot of times but um yeah so that is what i'm going to do the the weather's starting to change it's starting to get a little bit cooler um so i think that it's going to be okay having a blanket on me um we'll see <laughs> we'll see so because i actually put a sweater on this morning i couldn't believe it uh that kind of shocked me but anyway so yeah kids went back to school today that is definitely a sign of fall coming <laughs> kind of depressed me a little bit but anyway <laughs> Okay, um, so if you guys can go over to Heather's channel, her link is always down below, uh, and go show her some yarny love and go see what she's working on. Um, I think that you will be pleasantly surprised, uh, as I am every month with her because she always comes up with brilliant blankets. <sighs> she's like the blanket queen. So I hope I can do her just her justice. I can. I hope she'll be proud of me <laughs> for uh, this blanket that I'm going to attempt. And um, yeah. Okay. I love you all. And I will see you guys next week. Okay. Mm -hmm.